done. When you see a C double bonded to an O, what should you be thinking every single time? Anyone but Ben, or anyone but Ben, Brooke, or Paris? You see C double bonded to O, what do we know, slug? Yeah, which one is it here? No, we want to decrease the number of bonds to O, so it's reduction. Whenever you see a C double bonded to an O, you're going to get it back to an alcohol. Now, we're moving where the functional group is, from the second carbon to the first carbon. So anytime we have to move something, what's our next reaction? Nope. We can't add unless we have a C double, uh, C double bonded to a C. Elimination. We cannot add a double bonded functional group in, so we need two steps. Does anybody know our next step? Anybody, anybody, anybody? Brooke? Is it addition? We're going to add HOH because we need an alcohol to be able to do this. What's that last step? What is that? What's it called? Yep. If you see a C double bonded O, you're going to reduce it. If you're trying to make a C double bonded O, you need an alcohol and you got to oxidize it. Okay, here we go. 